Yeah, hi, Carl or Carl Matt or however I should pronounce your name. I'm not sure that, sorry. Uh, I thought a little bit how we can make the text workflow more efficient, how you can easily sync texts with markers or make it appear at markers and also get individual layers for the individual parts. And I came up with the following workflow with two new tools in our community library, namely change text at markers and split text layer into multiple layers, which you can greatly use in combination. First this one and then the other one. Let me show you how this is working. I select a text layer which I want on which I want to place the content, so to speak, and I run. And now you can enter here the full text that you want to appear step by step. So I just paste the sample text here. Here's my first paragraph and here's the second one and here's the third one. Now you can decide if this should appear on each marker word by word or line by line or paragraph by paragraph. And you wanted paragraphs, so paragraph would mean more than two space or line breaks between the different paragraphs in your input text here. Um, and then you can choose if you want to accumulate text. Accumulate would mean first only the first paragraph shows up, at the next marker the first two, at the next marker the first three texts and so on. Whereas without accumulate, this is where how I keep it now, first only this is variable is visible and then only this and this part disappears and so on. So, so we don't accumulate here and show it paragraph by paragraph. Now if I run this it says please add markers to this layer. So let's do this. We go to the very beginning and set a first marker. And now it says, here's my first paragraph. And I go here and set a second marker. Here and here is the second one. Uh, and here's the third one. So at each marker, a new segment of the text appears. When you disable the expression on this one, you can still see the full text. And you could also edit it here. He so I could go in here and say, and here is the new second one for example, and if I activate it now, we have here, here's my first, here's the new second one, and so on. So you can easily edit your text later too. And then if you say, okay, the texts are all great, the timing's all great, but you don't want to have here a single uh, layer, but you want to have an individual layer for each part, then you can simply run this second tool here, make sure that your work area includes the area including all those markers, because when we run it, this tool will or oh, please select exactly one layer. Yes, we have to select the text layer that we want to analyze. And then it will run over all frames in the work area and check where the source text of this changes. And this looks at keyframes and also expressions on the source text. So whenever the source text of the layer changes, it creates a new separate layer for this one. So we still have our original layer here with the markers at the bottom. But for each individual part, we now also have an individual layer that has no expressions on it anymore, no markers, no nothing, just a basic normal text layer with these texts uh, baked in, so to speak. So this is my idea for a super fast workflow of syncing text uh, to markers here real quick. And again, all you need for this are these two cool tools here that you find in our community library now.